hello you guys so i am back with another video today um in this video it's it's kind of short um because i've shown y'all how i made wigs plenty times before now it wasn't all right, so before y'all even try it with me, I am quite aware of the fact that my wig is not laid down and you can't see the lace. I am giving this wig away, so I did not want to add any glue to it. I wanted to leave it alone. So whoever gets it could have it fresh. Really detailed, but if you do want to see some more detailed wig making videos, you can go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And while you're subscribing, you can go ahead and go through and binge watch my videos, okay? Okay, <laughs> so all I did was show you guys um, how I did do this hair um, I gave an honest review um, I really do love this hair this hair was perfect for this hairstyle it curls so good so good I don't y'all know that I usually go for like the long straight bone straight hair you know little look but I decided to switch it up and I'm so glad that I decided to switch it up with this company um, Nadula hair Y'all got my yes. Y'all got my say so. Y'all got my recommendation. I just happened to be doing my outro a different day than when I did record. But I have not recurled this hair. Only thing I've had to do was like bump my little flip right here. My little bang. And uh, that was it. That was literally it. This hair holds curls so good. Um, so yeah, I will let you guys know how I did this. And I will let you guys know why I recommend them. Okay? Okay, so. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how I did this and if you did want to know how I did accomplish this look Then go ahead and keep on watching Okay, y'all so this is me doing my little cute unboxing of my hair So first things first they did send me three of their bundles I got a 18 inch bundle a 16 inch and a 14 inch girl And they also gave me their little business card along with some instructions on how to keep up your hair And make sure that it stays in perfect condition as long as you desire um, First I'm just going to show y'all my 18 inch bundle and I'm going to show you the closure that they sent me. Um, it was very easy to work with. Very easy to plug. And it just turned out so beautiful. Um, I'm definitely going to keep working with this company. Um, they they had probably the best hair that curled like that I've ever had. Like seriously. It's so soft, so silky, and so easy to maintain. So, okay, I'm just showing y'all my little things that I use to make my little wig. I got my little needle and thread and my um, dome wig cap along with some scissors. Um, I've shown y'all plenty of times how I make my wig. So, I made this really quick and easy. I'm so sorry. I just don't want to be repetitive for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I started out with my 18-inch bundle. I moved on up to my 16 and then I ended with my 14. And I did go ahead and put my closure first. Um... Prior to making this video, I actually hadn't bleached my knots on my closure, so, so I did do that once I got back home. I was here at my little part-time job doing this, y'all, at like 3 or 4 in the morning. Like, I was trying to work and get this done, you know? But, yeah, so I wasn't completely done. When I got home, like I said, I had to go ahead and pluck my closure and bleach it so it could be more customized and look more natural. So yeah, this was the finished look of the wig. I think it came out so pretty. I didn't have to curl it. Honestly, the way that this curl pattern was naturally, um, I would wear if I wanted to go for a more natural look. But um, yeah, that wasn't the style I was going for this time. Okay, so... Um, this was my first time trying the wig on since I had made it. Y'all know my little braiding process. I only did like six braids. Um, not many at all. But, man, I was a little discouraged when I first looked at this because I'm like, ew. Like, hold up. This looks so wiggy. But, you know, the plucking, the styling, the, um, I like to make my parts really defined. And, um, yeah, but like, girl, this looked a hot ass mess. <laughs> It looked a hot ass mess. My mom had walked in. She was like, oh, that ain't it. I was like, girl, give me some time because I know it looked a hot mess. But yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and style it and get it popping. 
and get it um you know looking like we want it to look so yeah i put in some nice curls with my flat iron i cut some layers and i made everything flat i also cut it the whole wig period because i wanted it to be more like blunt and choppy for whatever reason i don't know what i why i was doing it like that but yeah i got the bang the bang is what really set it off for me and when i put it on this time it looked completely different it was bomb like y'all see that part do y'all see that damn part it looked much much better it looks so sassy i really really loved how this came out So as I did mention earlier, I did not use like my um, glue. I didn't use like any ghost bond glue or any, you know, long lasting glue. I just used a little bit of my got to be gel just to lay the lace down a little bit. I really barely use any, okay? Because like I said earlier, I, what, I am getting rid of this wig. So I didn't want to put too much product on it at all um, around the lace. I wanted it to be, you know, fresh for whoever gets it. But um, yeah, I did lay down a little, little bit. Okay. J Mash and some groovy shit. All right, so next I did go ahead and cut off my excess lace. Um I it listen y'all I did not want to cut like a whole whole lot of the lace off because like I keep mentioning I'm giving this away so I did not want to um you know make it too custom to my own head so yeah I just cut off a little bit of the lace okay 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 and um I just kind of made sure everything was laid down and I did use my own sideburns and my own little baby hairs I didn't want to um I just didn't want to touch the hair a lot. I think this still came out really, really cute. It was popping. Okay. And it got the job done. <laughs> and it was it was flawless. I loved it. Alrighty, lastly, I did just get some of my Fit Me um, powder by Maybelline, and I just went in with a small little precision little brush, um, and I just defined my part a little bit more, made everything seem a little bit more realistic and seamless, you know what I'm saying? And then, girl, I was done. This wig was so easy to make, so easy to put on. Y'all see, I didn't even wear no cap. I didn't do, like not much at all and it still came out really really cute um that gel was still drying a little bit in the front but it was so popping y'all i loved this look um i feel like i look grown and sexy and you know like i was on my you know what and <laughs> i just looked bossed up i really loved it and this hair was so beautiful to work with um thank you guys so much for watching if you aren't already subscribed um go ahead and do that and be looking forward to my next video Thank you. Bye-bye.